I'm waiting for the room to load up. I'm going to stay as calm as possible. I'm just... I'm going to stay calm. Hello, everyone. Um, I just woke up to Janelle Evans. She's from Teen Mom. I'm gonna. Ugh, I'm so sick of this. I'm, I'm staying calm. She was fired from this podcast. I have the proof. I have proof. Janelle. Okay, so she keeps lying, so does Gabby, you both are liars, I have the evidence, I have the receipts and proof. Janelle, I'm going to say something and I'm going to apologize to Chris because he doesn't like me talking about this, I love you honey and I apologize. She is accusing me of doing Xanax. And stealing her Xanax. That is a crime, Janelle. You cannot accuse someone of that. Everyone who is my fan knows that Xanax is what took my aunt's life. She was hooked on Xanax. She was my best friend. We were the same age. And she overtook it. And she became addicted to it. Which led to her death, ultimately making her commit suicide a day she took a lot of it. So, everyone knows I do not like Xanax. And if, obviously, if you're prescribed it, take it, you know, how your doctor tells you to, don't overtake it. But, I'm so sorry, honey, I'm going to have to say, I was pregnant. Why on earth? Would I be stealing your medicine? You accused me of that. That is illegal. Everything you are saying is a lie. You have a huge platform. You have a huge platform. You need to stop. I, I'm being calm. The reason I'm going live is because that is something that is very unacceptable. Please stop talking about my lips, guys. I know. I like them. Please stop. This is a serious manner. This is the story. Janelle, should we talk about how you and your husband had open containers in the car with your young child and I had to drive because I was so upset that you guys were even going to drive and so was Gabby. Gabby's the one who brought it up to everyone that you had open containers and were drinking and driving with your child. So don't even. And I was very upset about that and it killed me inside. So do not sit here and say I stole your medicine and that I do drugs. That is unacceptable. That is not okay. And I need to address this now because these group of people have been bullying me for a year. A year. She, When she was fired, she had called me when I was at the airport on her husband's phone and told me she was going to team up with these people. And threatened me. And guess what she's doing? She teamed up with these people. Now she's suing John for BS stuff. I never talked about the podcast. I didn't do it. Like, it's been months. I didn't talk about it. But you and Gabby would not stop. So I made a statement and I was polite enough to change names. I was very nice. I didn't say your real name. I didn't say her real name. I didn't say half the stuff that I wanted to say. And I was very polite. And you guys have lied about me time and time again. Now, accusing someone of stealing drugs is a huge no-no. A huge no-no and it's not okay you need to stop I did not want to get a lawsuit because the reason why I didn't sue you Janelle because I didn't want to have to deal with it because I've been dealing with a lawsuit all year and it's it's exhausting but now you're done 
I am suing and I'm done and I have all the proof and receipts. Stop lying about me. Accusing someone of stealing drugs is not okay. I was fine with you running your mouth saying lies because no one believed you. They saw my receipts. Everyone saw the truth that you were fired and all this stuff. But accusing someone of stealing drugs is another level. It's not okay. It's unacceptable. It's really not okay. You don't accuse someone of that. I'm calm now. I'm calming down. Thank you. Unacceptable. Unacceptable, Janelle. And I will be leaving this live video up. You are lying. You are hurting other people. You were fired. Get over it. It wasn't because of me. Gabby, it's really unfortunate that you keep lying for this woman. It's really unfortunate. You are a very talented young woman. I don't understand it. Thank you, everyone. I did. I made my point. I'm calm down now. I'm calm. I just had to get on because I... I, you, I've been ignoring it the year. I was trying to be the adult and not go live, not cause all these things. I didn't talk about the podcast. I finally did make a thing because they wouldn't stop talking about it. And they have huge platforms. It is slander. It is defamation. And if I were to take it to court, I would win. Stop saying Gabby when it's Janelle. No, Gabby did it too, guys. Stop. I've seen Gabby's video. She lied too. I'm... They need to stop. It's unacceptable. And if they want to do things like that in the adult world, adult things happen. It's unacceptable. Oh, anyways, I had to come live. I was not fired by Sharp Entertainment. I still have my contract, guys. I say it all the time. I wish they would fire me. I wish. Then I would feel so free. I am just so, so disappointed I'm very disappointed no I was not fired I want them to fire me then I can be out of this contract that'd be wonderful no take your proof take it to court Janelle I am taking you to court I am suing you now this is unacceptable I promised my love I wouldn't get into a lawsuit I didn't want to go through that pain but accusing me of stealing your drugs is illegal I will report it to the police and as for the owner of the podcast, his name is also Chris, so he's a different Chris. As for the owner of the podcast, I hope you're proud of yourself. I hope you're proud of yourself because you said you were going to fix this. You said you were going to send out the C&Ds. You didn't. You didn't protect us. And honestly, ooh, what a mistake. What a mistake. I never talked about the podcast, guys. I waited till the last minute, and when I did... I changed names and I was being polite. Janelle, you are a liar. Stop lying about me. I already gave everyone the receipts. I will save the rest of them for court. This is unacceptable. Unacceptable. I was pregnant. I would never. Whew. Okay. I am done. I had to say it. I know it's going to upset people. I talked out, but... I, I've been letting them bully me and harass me. She's part of this group of people who have been stalking and harassing me. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. Anyways. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. And I didn't know about Janelle's past. I'm sick of people saying I did. No, I didn't fucking know. She told me that same night. I was like, oh, oh, oh. And I will show all our DMs. I'll show the proof. She, she scammed me out of money before. She scammed me out of money on this. Unacceptable. You do not accuse someone of stealing your medicine. I can't even take that type of medicine because of what happened to my aunt. So don't even. And like I said, if you have that medicine, no hate. Take it as you're supposed to. But for to say that. unacceptable she showed you posting on tiktok under the comments i didn't have a tiktok what are you talking about i got my tiktok the second the pod i was hired for the podcast what are you talking about 
Oh my God, you guys do realize she fucking fakes shit all the goddamn time. I started my TikTok for the podcast. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. I didn't watch her whole video because I just got so mad about the medicine thing. No, court will solve it. Janelle, you are a liar. You are committing defamation. This is unacceptable. I know you're in some fake fucking lawsuit. Sorry, I curse. I didn't mean to curse. You're in some fake lawsuit, but I can assure you, sweetheart, this will be a real one, and you cannot use Joe for it. I am done. And just so you guys know, Joe is the same as Yahaha's lawyer who did Yahaha. So I can't say it, but wake up. Wake up and see this harassment and bullying. Anyways, I'm not deleting this message. I normally delete my lives. I'm keeping this up. Janelle, you lied. You're a liar. Saying, accusing me of stealing something. And I haven't even watched everything. I haven't watched it all. That was the one thing that was sent to me. That is unacceptable. Unacceptable, Janelle. You do not lie about that. First of all, that is highly illegal. I could go to jail. Why would you lie about that? You can't say that type of stuff. That is unacceptable. Sorry, guys. I just woke up. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. Janelle, Gabby, both of you, I'm, you're done. I'm done. Both of you. I don't care where people say Gabby didn't do anything. She did. She lied. I have proof. I recorded her for my documentary. She said she was drunk and I took advantage of her. I didn't. She was dead ass sober. It was morning and she just said that because she's scared because the whole entire time for my documentary she was talking shit about Janelle. So I am done. I will see all of you in court. I am done. Pay, play big kid games. I will play them back. I will work so hard. I didn't want to get back. You're done. You are done. For the love of God, I am sorry. I'm not trying to get upset, but done. You guys are liars. I left it alone. Why do you guys keep bringing it up? I was the only one who didn't speak about it publicly, make any comments about it publicly because I was polite. But then you two had to go and lie, lie, lie. And when I did finally tell the truth, I had the respect to change your guys' names. When I told my side of my story. And it wasn't even really about you. It had to do with the fact that I was stalked and harassed for a year. And that Janelle decided to join those people and continue doing it. Unacceptable. 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 That's why I came live real quick. To say that is unacceptable. And if you don't know, you guys now know I've been stalked and harassed for over a year now. We had to move. These people live really close to me. It was very scary the past year what these people were doing. Okay? And Janelle knew that. She knew about these people. And then she decides to call me and tells me at the airport, I'm going to team up with them and ruin you. And guess what? Now she's on a, a fucking lawsuit suing John Yates with these people. Play big kid games. I am suing. This is unacceptable. I will see you in court. I am done. Thank you. Sorry, guys. I didn't mean to get upset, but something like this, you cannot lie about that, Janelle. You need help. Get help. You obviously need help. You are a compulsive liar. There is something mentally wrong with you. You need to go get help. You do. You need help. It's very unfortunate. Very unfortunate. You need to, first off, you need to stop drinking. It is unacceptable how much you and your husband drank around your child and then drove with her in the car. That is unacceptable. I have proof of that too. So don't come here and say, you didn't do that. So don't say, you're going to sue me and I'm going to lose because you didn't drink and drive. You did. Both of you did. It was unacceptable. I was very uncomfortable with it. It's unacceptable how you guys brought like a huge amount of marijuana, like... Like, it's like this much and traveled with it somewhere where it's illegal with your child in the car. Unacceptable. You broke the law. And don't say, here. I have a medical card. It's fine. No, you have a medical card for California, which means it's for California and the states you were in. It was highly illegal. So traveling with that much with your child in the car. Yes. Unacceptable. Driving high and drunk with your child. Unacceptable. 
lying, unacceptable. Guess what? I didn't say that because I was respecting you because I felt so bad that you had to do that. You need help. Get help. You both need help. You need help. I wanted to call the police. I did. I told the podcast people, I said, we need to do something about this. And they wouldn't do it. They didn't want to stand up for the child. They said, you know, that's just how it is over here. And that was the moment I quit. I told them I didn't want to be a part of it anymore. If this is the image, I don't want to do it. I quit first and said I wasn't going to do it. And then they asked me if we, it'll be fine. We already wanted to fire Janelle. So they fired Janelle and they said, can you at least come to the party? I had already quit. I was done. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. You are as guilty. No, I did. I, I told everyone. Gabby's the one that brought it to everyone. It is unacceptable. Unacceptable. Anyways, I am finished. I am finished. These are all Janelle's people in here. I will. I, I, I'm not going to say what I did on my end to protect the child, but I did what I could and it's unacceptable and I will see you in court, Janelle. That is my message. Thank you. Bye-bye. Magazine.